hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button also if you are returning it's been a while so i know you guys haven't seen me in quite some time however it's because i was too busy trying to be a perfectionist my problem that is my problem um no but honestly so i've been trying to figure out ways to basically i don't know mm, how do i put this i guess basically build my channel um i've been figuring trying to figure out how i can continue to grow for you guys um because i love what i do um however i also felt like i was at a roadblock and i don't know if it was due to just like the lack of support or whatever the case may be um but it's kind of crazy when you tell somebody that you're doing something or that oh i want to be a youtuber i want to be an influencer i want to be a blogger i want to do this or i want to do that it's easy for people to be like oh you won't make that don't worry who's gonna watch it you know it's easy for people to do that because they don't know how to do so themselves so yeah i kind of got stuck at a roadblock because i want to do all these things and i'm trying to do them all at once when i needed to just slow down focus on the one thing and focus on the path that god is actually calling me to because i do believe that god has placed me here for a reason and i didn't just wind up here without cause so without further ado if you guys sing by the title you guys are going to learn 50 facts about me today because i don't believe i've ever introduced myself on my channel um so yeah this is going to be basically a get to know me 50 facts about me make sure that you leave some comments in the comment section about yourself let me know if some of these things actually pertain to you because uh I'm sure they do girl because I mean <laughs> whatever no I'm just kidding but um yeah I actually want to make sure you guys love my content and you love that uh, what I do and that I'm not just throwing something out there I want it to be purposeful I want it to be meaningful and I want you guys to gain something from it because I do believe that is what God has over my life so yeah if you like this video make sure you leave a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment section below hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and if you are welcome back i love you guys dearly so without further ado let's just get into it by the way i'm old school so if you guys see me with some paper it's because i'm old school i like to write things down i am a pen and paper type of girl so yeah first fun fact my real name is michelle lenore so that is why you see it all over my channel because that's my name that's who i am i can't change that i got my middle name from my grandmother second fun fact her middle name was uh lenore and yeah she was perfect so i got it from her <laughs> I am 29 years old. I live in Kansas City, Missouri. Kansas City, hello. Um, I plan on one day to switch states. Not exactly sure. I want to move. I want to branch out. I want to actually explore other states. And I don't know if it's necessarily going to be a permanent move, but I defi that's definitely something that I'm interested in. Um, I am a mother of two girls, two beautiful little girls. One is the age of two, and that's Raya. I'm sure you've seen her. And Kamaya is the age of one. I'm sure you've seen her. If you haven't, I'm sure I'll link a video here somewhere with them in it so that you can just see my little girls. And yeah, but I'm sure you'll be seeing more of them. Another fun fact, I decided to start posting every Thursday. I am giving more of me to you. <laughs> um, I'm a full-time stay at home working mom makes perfect sense doesn't it so i currently mother my children from sunday to sunday that is a 25 a job and i wouldn't change it for the world however 
another fun fact i actually work in a healthcare field healthcare field i'm sorry i got tongue tied um i work overnight so yes i still have my girls during the day so when i say full-time mom i mean full-time mom by the time i leave for work they are already down for bed and done for the evening um also i am currently in a relationship another fun fact uh i'm a christian i mean can you tell <laughs> i'm a christian and my grandmother was a minister my grandmother was perfect <laughs> um I, I love to cook i love to cook everything from scratch sis everything i mean from the desserts to the breakfast to the lunch and the dinner i love to cook it from scratch um however i do try to find easy meals if it's going to be a crazy busy day for the girls so i will try to find a um easy meal for them um i'm a night person i am not a morning person i've been working on it though um i've been trying to get up <laughs> a lot earlier than i have been because I have different goals for my life now. So yes, I'm definitely making the time. I wear a size eight and a half shoe. I know it's common because I can't never find my size in the store. So save your girl son. Uh, I love shopping. What girl doesn't? Um, I've also learned that I am very high maintenance. Another fact. <laughs> um, I have a standard date every year with my mom for the Bath and Body Works candle sale. If you haven't gone to the candle sale, what are you waiting for? I get all my candles for the year on candle day. And hopefully this video is out or you've seen this video prior to candle day because maybe I'll catch you there. See you there sis because I will be there this year and I will be vlogging that. And if you've been on my channel long enough, if you know, you know. Okay? <laughs> um also like i said i keep looking down because i'm looking at a paper um i was raised by a single mother of four hey mom love you uh my mom does watch my videos so another fun fact uh i my favorite candy is hershey's cookies and cream which is kind of awkward because i hear a lot of women say that they are fans of chocolate mm, i could care less um a lot of people is like well you like cookie hershey's cookies and cream i do however it's condensed milk versus actually being chocolate so and then like my second favorite candy after that is reese's pieces and that's kind of peanut butter you don't really taste the chocolate on that um they kind of go hand in hand for me i love both of them i have two older brothers and an older sister and they watch my videos as well hi i love you guys and if they don't i don't know what they doing they crazy uh <laughs> i have four best friends three of them which are female and then one that is a male i'm a homebody i do not like leaving the house not at all i would love to be here 25 8 probably not here here because um Another fun fact, eventually I would love to build a house um, or find a fixer upper that I can tweak every little thing to my liking problem. <laughs> Might as well just build a house, sis, right? Uh, <laughs> so yeah, I mean, eventually I love to stay at home. I love being with my girls. I wouldn't change that at all. However, sometimes mama need a break. I'm tired. <laughs> no I'm just kidding I mean when I say tired I mean like real life sleepy <laughs> um I love to decorate I'm interested in starting a book club so if you love to read books let me know down in the comment section below and let's get that cracking because your girl your girl loves to find books y'all um I also love to sing I love to sing I have been singing since I have had a voice I'm assuming because it hasn't gone anywhere and I still love to sing <laughs> and I will still continue to sing um my favorite time of the year holidays obviously and if you don't love the holidays what are you thinking I love Halloween I love Thanksgiving I love Christmas I love New Year I love the atmosphere um I feel like it brings thanks it, get, it brings Thanksgiving um 
everybody around that time always seems to be in the best of spirits and i just love the whole atmosphere of that um i am a natural hair easter <laughs> i can't do hair worth or nothing y'all but for whatever reason i decided to go natural so it is what it is i am currently engaged i am engaged and another fun fact my fiance and i own a lawn care company um another fun fact i want a lot of children and if you've been here long enough you know that and if you haven't i'll leave that video in the description box below so that you can go and watch that video or whatever <laughs> Uh, I'm also interested in adoption. I am also interested in adoption. Uh, I have my respite license, which is like one step before you go to adopting. Respite is more like foster care and things like that, where you take in children for the weekend or whatever. So yeah, I have my respite license. Um, also, I've been on YouTube for three years now. Oh my goodness. Um, it should be going on four. If you guys are, if you guys have been on my channel for quite some time, then you will see that it only says I've been here two years. And that's because I had a channel before this channel. Don't go searching. <laughs> but yes, I had a channel before this channel and it's on the internet, you guys. What you find is what you find, okay? <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so I ha I, I've been on YouTube for just about four years now and the thing about it is I have not been consistent we are starting anew which is why I am giving this video to you guys so that you guys can get to know me and get to love me for who I am because I'm gonna love you without condition without limit and without judging okay because I'm here um also I love planning. I love planning and I love organization. When I say planning, I love like mapping out my life, mapping out detail, writing things down. I love organization. I'm one of those people that has a pantry. I'm one of those people that think I'm supposed to have a Pinterest fridge in which I do. Whatever it is what it is. I just do not like clutter um, anywhere. Uh, you wouldn't be able to tell by this, but this was a clothing haul if you guys have been on my channel <laughs> but it's here so you know whatever uh i also have two bonus children another fun fact i have an older daughter and a son and i love them as if they were mine as if i gave birth to them and my kids ain't going nowhere okay <laughs> and they know that which is really nice they know that i love them unconditionally so um, it's not every day that that happens for children, so I'm happy that they feel that way. Also, I just started getting pedicures, you guys. Um, I've always taken care of my feet. However, um, my mom used to take me to get pedicures when I was younger, and I hated it. Um, partly because I am ticklish on my feet. Secondly, because I hate the latex gloves on my feet i still hate them until today and it has taken the grown woman in me to actually continue to sit there and get a pedicure okay because um i've been doing it i've been doing it lately <laughs> i love fashion i love diys and if you've been on my channel you know that um i also have a cricket explorer air 2 you guys might have seen that haul I haven't used it why why um because I had kids and my life just got a little bit more busy than what I thought it was gonna be because I just knew I was gonna create everything cute and it's just not working out <laughs> it's not working out that way but I am trying to find the time to get that done to include them in my life and just basically I don't know guys I'm at the point where I am finding who I am and that is okay that is perfectly okay I'm very sarcastic if you can tell I mean it could be a good thing and it could be 
a bad thing depending on what side of the situation you're on another fun fact i am always cold if i look like this it's because i'm freezing like real life cold right now like trying to make this video for you guys but i love you no less so it's gonna get done <laughs> also another fun fact I am with child. I'm expecting another baby. So if you guys have been on my channel, then you know, another fun fact, this would be my fourth pregnancy. So like I stated, I have two older little girls. However, I had a daughter right before them. I'm sorry. I kind of got a little whatever. Right before them, I had a daughter and I actually lost her. And I am now expecting another child. I am with child. I am currently at this point 13 weeks. So welcome to the journey of, um, you know, carrying with me once again. <laughs> so yeah, um, if you guys want to know more about like me and my older daughter and that situation or whatever let me know in the comment section below because i might have been through something that you guys may have experienced and you want to talk about or maybe just need an outlet i'm here sis i still grieve because that is my daughter i love my baby you know i still grieve and i'm still learning to deal and heal in that process okay um what else i am currently trying to understand my place in ministry I am trying to understand where God has called me to be. I do feel like right now he has me on a path to just speak. Um, right now he has me on a path of getting over my fears, trying to basically lean and depend completely on him. And I am doing that. I am doing that. At this point, God, I'm done running, okay? <laughs> I'm done running. I am done running. Um, my dream job is influencing and blogging. I want to start a mom blog. <laughs> um, it's actually something that I've been in the works on for a while. But like I said, I am a perfectionist. So if I feel like it's not quite right, then I'm not going to... I don't know i'm not going to give you guys that content because i still feel like i everything has to be perfect it has to look like this it has to look like that it has to say this it has to be that i critique everything i'm sorry i am very sorry for that um yeah another fun fact about that i am on a path of getting consistent with god okay because i feel like I am one of those people that's like, oh God, I forgot to stop and pray. Let me pray. Or I wake up and I am probably worried about the things from the day before or the things that's coming after that I don't even think like, oh dang, I didn't pray first. So I am trying to get in a habit of, oh, okay, maybe 12 o'clock every day I need to pray, which is really hard as well because you do have children and you never know what life is going to bring you. So I'm just basically trying to get on a path in which I focus completely solely on God and that I am giving him my focus for at least an hour. Um, what else? Oh, another fun fact. I want a farm. I want a farmhouse. Uh, I want to live on the farm. That has been my dream for quite some time. I want the animals. I want the farm life. I want the vegetables. I love everything about it. Another fun fact, I currently have like a little vegetable garden in my yard where I am currently harvesting some tomatoes, I'm harvesting some carrots, I'm harvesting some, um, what else do I have, like collard greens and things like that. So yeah, I'm working on it. You got to start off small and then go big, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, another dream, another fun fact about me is I want to build my home I do believe I said that already um I also want a Kia Carnival because where am I gonna put all these kids that I just told y'all I wanted where just where <laughs> I want a lot of children like I said I do want a lot of children I'm not sure on the number whatever God give me I'm cool 
okay uh whatever he gives me i'm definitely open willing and honest about whatever decision god has made over my life because obviously he knows my steps before he's guided me there um i want the kia carnival 2022 but I'm going to say that right now. I'm going to go ahead and put speak that in the atmosphere. I am going to get a Kia Carnival 2022 <laughs> so I can house all my children. <laughs> um, also, another fun fact. I can't do hair, but I love doing the girls' hair. Isn't that something? I love it. I love being a mother. So any everything about them, I love. Um, also, I love pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie pumpkin spice i love um pumpkin ice cream i love pretty much anything pumpkin which is so awkward because also another fact i am not a fan of sweet potato pie i know don't judge me don't judge me don't <laughs> i'm not judging <laughs> i used to be a barista I used to be a barista, which is partly the reason why I love pumpkin. I fell in love with Starbucks pumpkin spice. So I, at first I started doing like, um, the pumpkin spice creamer because in the beginning I hated coffee until I became a barista and life for me just changed at that moment. <laughs> life for me changed at that moment. I want to, I wouldn't say right through the door. Um, it actually took some getting used to and my boss having to say oh well we have to taste these things we have to learn we have to be able to tell our customer about our coffee we have to be able to explain to them the rich taste the hearty taste and this and that and just basically where it was curated from and just all of the background history on that and before coffee before starbucks you know coffee was just coffee to me <laughs> it didn't have the backstory but just coffee <laughs> but yeah also Another fun fact, which I'm probably over in my facts, but you know, bonus facts for you guys. Uh, what else? I love romance movies and action. I feel like all girls like romance movies, but I could be wrong. Some girls may not like romance, but I do. I love romance movies and I love action movies. Another fun fact, I don't watch TV, right? Isn't that crazy? I don't watch TV. However, if I am, if I see something like maybe if I catch a trailer or something on my phone or it comes across uh, like YouTube or something like that and I catch a trailer, then that's how I know like when these romance movies are coming out and then I'll replay them like on Netflix or something or whatever. If the romance has actually caught my attention, then yeah, then I'll do that. Um another fun fact what else i think that's it i think that just about wraps it up guys so yeah welcome to 50 fun facts about me <laughs> um if you guys like this video like i said don't forget to leave me a comment in the comment section below let me know something about yourself welcome to my channel welcome to the new life of me <laughs> <laughs> welcome you guys um i will see you guys in the next video without further ado see you guys later bye